So in today's video, we're going to test out another item that I recently found in Costco. Did I say another food item? It's another healthy food item. Hello my friends, welcome to my kitchen. This is Miss Ming on my channel. I do a variety of lifestyle videos and food review videos. If you're interested in these videos, make sure you subscribe and ring the notification bell and check out my other review videos and haul videos after today's video. This is from the brand Tattooed Chef and this is the organic riced cauliflower stir fry. Apparently in this bag, it not only has the riced cauliflower, you know, the fake rice, but also other vegetables that you typically see in other like fried rice, stir fried rice. It has corn, peas, red bell peppers, sesame ginger sauce. Huh, so this is like a uh, Asian fried rice recipe instead of regular rice, it's cauliflower rice. So in each serving, there are only 60 calories, three grams of fat, two grams of fiber, three grams of sugar, no added sugar, and three grams of protein. So it's definitely like less carbs compared to regular fried rice. But does it really taste good? We're gonna try it out in today's video. We're going to cook it together and test out and review this item for you so that you can make a more informed decision before you buy it from Costco. A little bit of olive oil in a pan and put the frozen content of the bag, cook six to seven minutes and let stand for one minute before serving. So before you start, don't forget to subscribe and also give this video a thumbs up for the YouTube algorithm. It will really help me out. And so 10 minute cooking time and let's get started to cut to open this. Wow, nice surprise, yay. These are individually packaged, which is great. Just imagine if you just have one huge bag and then somehow you accidentally <sighs> spill it in your freezer. It's not gonna be happy, but hey, we have one. Wait, Simba. Sorry guys, sorry guys. Four, there are four individually packaged bags and 13 servings in total, which makes it three servings per bag. So this is probably 180 calories, maybe a little bit more. Let's just say 200 calories each bag. So four huge bags. I think this is good for at least one person, maybe two, I don't know. And we're gonna test out one of these. Let's go. We got the pan here and we're gonna use a little bit of olive oil. This one is flavored with lemon. It has some aroma, but it's not gonna change the flavor significantly. It says to cook it preferably with olive oil, so we use these olive oil. By the way, I highly, highly recommend extra virgin olive oil flavored with lemon. And let's turn on the pan. So as you heat up the oil, uh, you don't want to overheat the olive oil. And then now we're gonna put the frozen food out on the back. Ooh. Super frozen in a chunk. Ooh, this is definitely in a chunk, definitely in a chunk. Let's look at the cooking instruction. It does say add frozen content of the bag. So it didn't say defrost it. So I would assume I'm following the instruction and it's a little bit hard, but I assume it's gonna go well. It's just the cauliflower rice kind of fly out of the pan a little bit. Let's see if it's gonna work. Maybe our freezer is just too powerful. Oh, this is going to help a lot. Use a butter knife. Okay, now it's good. Now it actually looks like fried rice. Just gonna coat it with the olive oil. Looks pretty good. Okay, that looks pretty good. I think it's been about six to seven minutes. I think it's almost ready to go.
it's all cooked and ready within 10 minutes. And now it's time to try this out. Let's see. I assume the proper silverware to use is spoon, just because, you know, it's just super rised. Let's try it. Mmm! Mmm! The flavor is good! Mmm! So freaking good! First of all, the flavor. The sesame ginger sauce, oh, amazing. It definitely tastes like the Asian fried rice. And the texture is so good because the actual cauliflower rice is not mushy at all. Originally, I was like, this is probably gonna be mushy, but no, it's actually pretty crunchy, but not too crunchy. It's kind of like crunchy, but a little bit like rice. I can't describe it. It's not mushy at all, but of course, I didn't overcook it. If you overcook it, I'm pretty sure it's gonna become more and more mushy. And the peas and other like corns and stuff, it adds a lot of flavor, especially the bell peppers and corns. It adds a little bit of sweetness. So although there is no added sugar, there's definitely a little bit of sweetness from the vegetable. And the texture is so good. And I love this sesame ginger sauce. Originally, I was like, it's probably gonna be too gingery, but no, it's kind of like sesame soy sauce with a little bit of spice from the ginger. It's so good. Actually really good. Look at the consistency. It's kind of like a rice with a little bit of crunchiness. Wow. It's, this is really impressive. It's healthy, it's nutritional, it has low calories, and it's super easy to make, and it also tastes good, so I'll have to give it 10 out of 10. <gasps> Yummy! Look at this rice. This is so good. Amazing, amazing. Highly, 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 highly recommend. I picked it up at the frozen food aisle, so highly, highly recommend. I'll give it a 10 out of 10. It's healthy, flavorful, I love the texture, and if you have a lot of food restrictions, and this will work for you too, so super good for a low-carb diet. Alrighty, that's it for today's review video. I hope you enjoyed it. I love this item this is going to be on our list and if you love cauliflower this is a must try if you love cauliflower alrighty that's it for today's video if you like it please give it a thumbs up for the youtube algorithm and also comment down below what other healthy item from costco that you recommend and before you go don't forget to subscribe and ring the notification bell and i'm gonna go enjoy my cauliflower fried rice yummy yummy in my tummy and i will see you in my next video Bye! Cheers! Cauliflower rice cheers! Bye! Bye! Yum yum! Oh, it looks so good! I'm gonna bring it next time when we have a potluck. <laughs> mm -hmm.